Aftab Saluda from Silvers has joined us at this ETC so annual conclave. So first thing first, your thoughts about being at the event and how has been the event treating you so far? Uh, it's been a great pleasure to be part of this event. Uh, being uh, Udaipur being my hometown, I really feel uh, proud to be hosting this event and really thank the ET for being uh, bringing all the community together, especially the CISO community and the partners. And it's one of the events where you can see, meet all the people, colleague, uh, connect with the network. Uh, important part is what I really, uh, for me, is that because the CISO committee will have a more global view for this event and really pleased to have being part of this. Thank you. Okay. Now let's try and understand about the challenges that you see that's emerging amongst the customers or probably in general. I see there are three key components which has come out from the challenges based on my discussion with all the CISOs and the partner. The first one is on the compliance because more and more regulatory compliance from the industry, uh, from the government is coming into play and how do we manage that compliance on and on. The second is the security incident management because although there are so many tools, products in there, but still there's a big threat landscape going on and how you can really manage incident and this is something which everybody is really keen to look into. It. The third thing which has come up is on the manufacturing or the OT security side or anything on the OT security. And it's very important that all the businesses start looking from it, like whether it's a healthcare, which has got a medical devices, whether it's a retail, whether they've got the stores, whether it's a, uh, any of the factory side. So how do you bring that uh, data into perspective and look into monitoring from that? So those are three things. Just to summarize, compliance, incident, and the OT security side. Uh, we were talking about the challenges. Now, we have already addressed the three points, the three challenges, right? Now, what are the solutions that you're offering to mitigate those challenges for your customers? So, the three challenges, what we discussed, the first one, the compliance management, which is definitely required to build a uniform compliance framework, which can bring all the compliance requirements, whether it's a DPP or all the security requirements, to perspective. The second is on the incident management, which definitely required to bring the larger ecosystem partner. And what we can do, we work with the partners and bring like an as a service, which can really bring in your threat intel, threat hunting and all the services together and bundle it and provide a service. The third aspect is on the OT security, which is very important. And that required experience, not only just bringing the product into the perspective, but also the experience of dealing with those environment. And that's where we really bring that expertise of dealing with the manufacturing side from the healthcare on the medical devices perspective. And that's we really bring it to the table. And lastly, three key, key takeaways that you would like to take from the ETC final conflict. Uh, the key takeaway is especially again having these kind of events really helps to bring the community together. I will give one example that I have never met so many talents uh, or talented security professional just in Udaipur city and we are now forming a community and thanks to ET for bringing us together for that. That's a key takeaway. Second, the learning has been immense. The sessions were really good which really helped us to bring some of the perspective about the what's happening in the future and what's we can start doing from the now perspective, that's the second. And the third is the partner community because that itself is very important. And I see really good impact from Make India perspective, which is really going to drive a lot of digitalization and the cybersecurity services from India. So I'm really pleased to see that how this is taking to uh, one from a country perspective and also uh, maturing the security service for the corporates in India. Thank you so much for talking to us. I hope you enjoyed the rest of the evening well. Absolutely. I'm really looking forward to the evening also.